when I come to this place and I see a place that was once forgotten and out of the way and inaccessible really, and then I can see how a building activates and provides access to a place like the Chicago River, it really excites me. It, it's introducing a whole new public to the riverfront and showing what the potential of that river can be. We basically studied the motion of rowing through photography and also through actually going out and rowing ourselves. We created a time-lapse sequence of the oars movement and that was really inspiring to us to try to extrapolate something interesting from that. It turned out that by alternating the roof trusses between this kind of V and an M, which are the two motions in the stroke, by uh, connecting the two, you actually get this warped surface, but you do it using all straight elements, so it was actually economical to build. I'm really happy with how it turned out because we were able to do something that was economical, but through our use of technology, make it something that was really three-dimensional and sculptural on the inside. And then at the same time, it's introducing a whole new public to the riverfront and, and showing what the potential of that river can be.